Relief and Hill Shading is a web application that allows you to visually analyze the orientations and slopes of the terrain. It shows a digital terrain model. In this case, a 2 meter mess passage on which the user can interact by modifying the visual aspects, both those referring to the slopes and the orientations of the slopes. This sphere is what we call a sphere map. This is where the user can paint with different colors, choosing colors from this palette and also choosing the thickness. For example, if we paint the central area of this sphere, this sphere map, we will be painting the flattest areas of this digital terrain model. On the other hand, if we select with another color the peripheral areas of the sphere map, what we are doing is to paint the steepest areas. Beyond painting, Here is the slope with its percent and the degrees on the terrain. We see that these mountainous areas where the slope is higher are displayed in red. For intermediate values, we can choose any other color. We can choose a color that is yellowish, and we will paint these intermediate sections of the area. The user views these changes in real time within the map. This would be a first resulting map. It is also sensitive to the orientations of the slopes. For example, if we now want to paint, we will do so with a rather lush color. We could paint this sector of the sphere map, the northwest facing slopes, and here we would have the slopes of the mountain oriented in this direction. If, on the contrary, we prefer to orientate, and this could be done with a color marking the orientation to the southeast, those facing in this direction, then we would get this other result. So, it is a tool that graphically allows you to play with the terrain and demonstrate the reference aspects with both the orientations and the slopes of the terrain. Here in the upper part is the sphere map. We can save the sphere map we've generated in case we want to reuse it and load a sphere map that we have already worked on. So let's do this. or even some styles such as this pencil, a bit more artistic. This is a tool that is both professional and a meeting point between the technical world and the most artistic side of cartography. <laughs>